Greetings, I'm Professor K, and in this short video presentation, we're going to see how we go about using Server Manager to install the DHCP role for Server 2019. And though I'm using Server 2019 to demonstrate this procedure, the procedure is exactly the same for Server 2012 and Server 2016 and Server 2019. So to begin this installation process of the DHCP server role, I'll be using Server Manager. Now it's no different than installing any other role. So we're going to go up here to Manage. We're going to select Add Roles and Features. When the wizard opens up, we're going to just accept the defaults, role-based or feature-based installation, and we're going to say Next. We're going to make sure that we have the right server selected. If we have more than one server, currently configured to be managed by server manager on this machine. I only have one server, so we're good to go. I'll click Next. Here we're going to go ahead and select the box for the DHCP server role. We're going to add the features, and now we're going to click Next. We're going to accept the defaults, click Next. And here you get some information about exactly what DHCP does, and we're going to click Next. And now we're ready to install. If you want to check the box to restart, you can. No restart is actually necessary. So I'm going to go ahead and just begin the installation. Now once the role has completed its installation process, we can go ahead and close the wizard. And you're going to have a couple of warnings up here. So let's go ahead and see what those notifications are. First, it wants us to complete the DHCP configuration. So let's go ahead and do that. And here we're going to tell it which group is going to have access to the DHCP configuration. So we're going to go ahead and say commit, and we're going to close. Now we're ready to go up here to tools, and we can find the snap-in for DHCP to open up the DHCP management console. Let's go ahead and expand this whole screen. Let's go ahead and move over this left window pane. And now you can expand your DHCP options that you have here. You have one for IP version 4 and you have one for IP version 6. Now currently there's no scope options so you can right click here and you can configure your first scope by launching the new scope wizard. And we'll cover all that in another video where we configure or we build a scope for our DHCP server. And so that's going to conclude the short video presentation on how we go about installing the DHCP server role for Server 2019. So if you have any questions or you have any concerns about any of the information that was presented to you in this short video presentation, please do not hesitate to reach out, contact your instructor, and I'll see you in my next video.